Back to back beamers, you know what I'm saying? Got the other one over there, protected. I need y'all help with this. Let me show y'all what's going on right here. I need y'all help with this. So I got the hood all patched up because I'm scared. I need an undercover for my engine bay. It's nothing under here to stop water from getting in my engine bay. That's an open hole, that's an open hole. This is an open hole and this is an open hole. It's crazy. That one feel wet, okay? It ain't that bad. Yeah, uh, can you help me find an undercover? that go for this hood, it, the hood, when I searched it, it come with an undercover, but you can't just buy it separately, and it's a $1,500 hood. I mean, yeah, $1,500 hood. I don't have 15 to buy, drop on a whole nother hood just for the underside of it, I'm not gonna lie. Hopefully my packaging did well. But yeah, if y'all could help me find that and drop it in the comments for me, I would really love that because Every time it's about to rain, I have to patch it up. And this is annoying. And I have something big coming for this car also. This car gonna take me some years, I'm not gonna lie. That 335 gonna take some years. But I'm finna make this car fast real soon. Y'all gotta stay tuned. When I, around October, when we in July, I plan on having this car done around October. Y'all, the 135 i is so scary, I'm not gonna lie. I just did a few, it's only scary because it's so lightweight. It made the car scary. After October, after October, I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do it. <laughs> this shit is so scary. Bro, it's so light. It's like when I'm when I'm on half throttle and I hear the exhaust screaming, I know it just wanna take off. And it do, even on half throttle, it's taking off because like, I don't know. I, I feel like the turbos are bad. So initially when it starts screaming, it's not floating for real. But actually like, once it like hit third gear, it just start flirt, floating. And that shit's when it gets scary. After it hit third gear and that bitch started gliding, oh my God. <laughs> After October, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do it. <laughs> the car is already scary now. It's not faster than my last car, but it's how the third gear feel like. <laughs> I know the first and second gear are dirt slow, but when that third gear kick in, it's like it's literally gliding and that's so crazy. Right there. Ah. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, the streets are terrible. We did have a, a hailstorm last yesterday. Not last night, but yesterday it was a hailstorm out here. Man. Do I wonder if y'all get, can y'all hear the exhaust screaming? Let me know. I know I posted a previous video where I know for a fact you can hear it screaming, but man. This car's already something else. And it's, I don't, it feel different. Like I know it's not faster than a 335, but man, it just feel different. I guess 200 pounds actually make a difference in a dang car. Yeah, I hear that? Oh. <laughs> Let me know how do y'all feel about the exhaust? I used to not like it, but then it kind of sound like a, I don't know. I really, I really don't know how I feel about it still because it's so, it's a screech. It don't really sound like muscle. It don't, it don't sound like a turbo either. It sound like it have a fake little turbo whistle on it. And when I hit the gas, I just hear like a fake turbo whistle. I don't, it don't sound like a real turbo. I don't know. It sound, it kind of sound like a, a racing exhaust, but I still don't know. I really, I don't know how I feel about it. It's growing on me a little bit, but I'm not gonna just say I like the exhaust. Yeah, 
Yeah, I can't say I like it. Oh! You don't wanna smoke? Oh, yeah. That last gear, whatever, that had to be like fourth gear, actually. I think it's fourth gear, because when fourth gear hit, it feels so much different. That last gear, right when I hit 100 and it shift, it just felt like my whole body just picked up, like, like, like it's boosted by gears or something. I'm not gonna say the car is boosted by gears, but it really, it feel like it's boosted by gears. The first few gears don't feel that fast, but the third or the fourth, which when I'm looking at it, I'm pretty sure that was fourth gear just then. It's like my whole body picked up, like, <laughs> yo, I love it. I love it. I love the car. They haven't gave me issues yet. I had one issue, which I feel like it happened because the car was cold, but my radiator, my radiator popped, but I was pushing the car while it was cold. So it's like, what you expect, Trey? That wasn't smart. Ooh, we, I know for a fact when I, this October, I gotta get brakes and tires for this car. <laughs> If this shit scaring me now, I know it need brakes and tires. And it, I don't know why it's scaring me, y'all. It's so crazy. Like, it's scaring me, but I know for a fact it's not faster than my last car. I don't feel faster. It's, uh, yeah, I think it's boosted by gear. That's the only thing, I don't know. It just feel different when I'm driving it. Maybe it's the exhaust. Maybe it's the exhaust screaming like that. I don't know. Let's hit the corner. Going to the corner. Eh, eh. Let's do it. I'm not gonna lie, I do need a haircut. I'm really. I'm cutting up, I'm taking the back roads, but I'm trying to go get a haircut if I'm being honest. I need a haircut back. Let's get out of hand. I know y'all here. I'm not gonna even say it's, it's fourth gear that I pick up. It's, I don't know, it's, the gear shifts so slow, so when the power do kick back in, I feel my body raising up, literally. Uh, stage two, Stay, the stage two, I, I wanna say the car is stage two plus. I'm not sure, but I doubt the stock 135 I move like this. I don't got the, uh, I don't have it tuned on my phone, yeah, I don't have it mapped to my phone where I can really see what it is. I just got the car. But y'all yeah, finna buy all the packages for the N54. I know what I'm talking about. I, I can show y'all. The little app, the little downloadable app. Where is it at? Right here, the MHD N54 app. I gotta get it set to this car. I don't know why it wouldn't just all switch, but it didn't all switch. So I gotta get it set to this car and I can really see what it is. But I wanna say stage two. I really want to get a transmission tune on this car. That's what I miss the most about my Mustang. From me having a Mustang, I had the only tune I had on that car was a transmission tune. So, and I went to the 335R and I never got the transmission tuned on that. So yeah, I gotta see how the transmission tune feel on this car. Because just regular, not in sport mode, driving in that EcoBoost, the downshifts was crazy. It was just, it was always aggressive, no matter what. So when I put it in sport mode, it got like super aggressive. It was, it was so, it was fun. I ain't gonna lie. Sometimes I miss the little eco boost, but at the same time, I'd rather have the twin turbos. The twins are just, I don't know. I love how they feel. How they pick up speed just feel amazing to me. Chill. <laughs> that 
that's lit. Thank you for watching to the end, y'all. If y'all made it to the end, if y'all like the content I'm posting, please hit that like button. Comment if y'all like. Tell me something y'all like, y'all didn't like what I should do better. And subscribe for me. But until then, we're going to catch y'all in the next video. We out.